Okay, that and tracing question here. Uh, let's get started. So let's say, uh, oh my god, sorry, 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 sorry. Let's get started. So now they say here, uh, this is very, very interesting question. The interesting question. Okay? So town A and B are 300 kilometers apart. Okay. Let's assume this town A and this town B are 300 kilometers apart. Oh, so from here to there, 300 kilometers. So what do they say here? They say Susan. Oh, so we had a Susan. And travel from A to B. So she travel from A to B at the speed of so we have a speed of Susan. Also Teboho leave three mil, uh, minutes after Susan. Also Teboho came after Susan. But uh, uh three minutes after Susan. And then he travel from A to B, also travel from A to B. But his speed you see is bigger than Susan. So it's obvious Teboho Susan, if Susan goes slow, even Toboho leave late a little bit, but it's gonna come, possibly he's gonna arrive, uh, maybe same or he's gonna overtake Susan. Because his speed is higher or bigger. Toboho overtake Susan, oh, you see? At T hours after Susan, after time T, Toboho he overtake Susan. So let, let me tell you the base way that you can solve this question. Now they say, which equation can be used to solve the question for T? So the time where he overtake her, okay, let's say Susan live here, to here, and then overtake. The, he, they're gonna cover the same time. If this time is X, Teboho is where they overtake each other means they have the same distance. So something that we're gonna equate later is distance is gonna be the same. Because when they overtake each other, when Teboho overtake Susan means, when, okay, if we live at the same spot, but you go slow, and I go fast and I come and then I overtake you. Right there on a spot where I overtake you. Let me check there if it does record. Yeah, it does record. I like to check, you know, most of the time. So right there where oh, I overtake you means we cover the same distance. So me, for the most case, I'm not gonna, I'll just draw the table here. Let me show you the base way of solving this time. Of course, you draw your table. So let's draw a table here. And then here, write the names. And then here, write the details there on top. So the details, we just need three bucks here. Uh, let's write three bucks for distance here. And the last one, this is going to be total. Let me show you now. So let's plug in the names. So then the name, the face on is Susan. So let's write here Susan. And then here Tabal. And here Toto. These are the easiest and the base way. It's always lace trace. Okay. Right here, uh, write your distance. Uh, we have a speed, right? Speed. Or oh, you can start with the distance, doesn't matter. Speed. So our speed is in kilometer per hour. So you can write the units kilometer per hour. So here you don't have to write those units, okay? And then also another thing we have is distance. So distance is going to be what is it going to be in kilometer? Because kilometer per hour. Now right here, right time. And these are their total. Now let's go. Let's plug in what we have. So we know right there where they overtake each other, start to fill in the table, okay? Now we're gonna say we have a speed here, okay? Because they say town A to B, whereby they are 300. Susan travel from A to B at the speed of 8. Oh, so speed is 80 km per hour. So let's plug in the speed of A. Susan is 8. So I'm not gonna write km per hour because it's already there. Now, we also have a speed of Teboho and also, uh, also, uh, Oh, right here. I'm always just trying to check. Uh, Teboho leave 30 minutes after Susan and he traveled from A to B at the speed of 100. Also, Teboho is 100. So I don't have to write kilometer per hour because he's already there on top. Now we go. What else do we have? They give us time. Who's time? They say here, Teboho overtakes Susan at T hours after Susan has left. Oh, so Teboho is going to use how long? T hours because this time let's put here hours. 
table was three hours. You see what I'm saying? But look, if Susan is gonna live here, and then she's going slow, how did I know? Because her speed is 80 km per hour. And then let's say she got overtake here at this distance x. This is what Susan. And then Tebo, his speed is more, which is 100 km per hour. And then it's gonna come and overtake Susan at uh, the same distance because when he overtakes, it's gonna be the same distance. But this guy's time, look, this guy's time. What about this guy? This guy's time is gonna be because look, this guy he left. Tebo left 30 minutes after Susan. So if Tebo left 30 minutes after Susan, means Tebo used less time and then he went and overtake Susan. Oh, so for other case, Susan used more time. So if Tebo used T, and then Susan is going to be T plus 30 minutes. Does that make sense? Because they say Tebo used T hours. And remember, Tebo used less time because he left after susan half an hour after susan so what does that mean oh so if table who used t minutes so susan means she used more time by 30 minutes you see what i'm saying so i'm gonna say table uh susan equal to t plus 30. does that make sense so now we gonna say now look we have a little triangle here i want you to get used to this so we say this triangle we say s d T, SDT, that is SDT. So if you want to use this, you say if you want to get distance, distance, or we can start with the speed. If you want to get speed, equal to distance for time. And if you want to get, uh, uh, let's say, whatever you want to get. Okay, let's say I want to get distance. What is distance? Distance equal to speed times time. So distance equal to speed times time. Okay, what about time? If I want to get time, equal to distance of our speed distance of our speed so for this case we know they're going to cover same distance so i want to say okay how i'm going to get distance oh i was supposed not to do that okay s d t how i'm going to get distance here distance equal to distance equal to speed times time because we want to get distance so distance equal to speed times time. So let's start with the distance of Susan. So distance of Susan equal to what is the speed of Susan? Eight times the time of Susan. What's the time of Susan? T plus 30. But this 30, remember, is in minutes. So do not leave in minutes. Say it's 30 over 60. Because the time must be in hours. So 30 over 60. So 30 over 60 equal to a half. So this may say half. Because it has to be an hour. So we're going to say time distance for uh, distance for Susan is going to be equal to 80 times T plus a half. You see? So this is for Susan. Now, let's get distance for table ho. What is distance for table ho? Distance for table ho is going to be uh, also speed times time. What is the speed? 100 times time. What is the time? Time equal to T. You see what I'm saying? So now remember that this is going to be equal because when the distance covered by Susan and the distance covered by Table Horse is going to be the same because they left at the same time, same time, same place, same time, but the table came and overtake her. When they overtake each other, means the speed is going to be, uh, the distance is going to be the same. So I can equate to this distance by saying distance, distance of Susan equal to distance of Table Horse. So I can equate this to by saying 80 t plus a half equal to 100 t. Okay, I hope it's visible. It's so faded away. Okay, so I can see. Let me write again. 80 t. Uh, 80 t plus a half equal to 100 t. Or you can write other way around by say 100 T. You want to just say 100 T equal to 18 T plus a half.
see so so this is the question that we're gonna use which equation can be used to solve the value of t so this equation is going to be used to solve the value of t but you know what in a written exam they're going to say for example because this is a question that they need here they're not going to just ask for a question they're going to say uh can you find the uh distance covered or oh, let's say uh what is the distance covered by susan so distance equal to uh distance of susan equal to 80 t plus a half and this is a table of equal to 100 what 100 t so we have to find the value of t so you can get the value of t here okay let's get the value of t so we can find the distance covered by susan and the other one and table so i'm going to say 100 t equal to 80 t and this one be plus 40. So this is going to come over, it's going to be 100 t minus 80 t equal to 20 t equal to 40. Divided by 20, divided by 20, so t equal to 2 hours. Or you can just say t equal to 2. So when you get t equal to 2, then I know exactly how many hours, for example, was covered by, by Teboho. Let me ask how many hours was covered by Teboho. Oh, Teboho, time for Teboho, time, Teboho. was what t which is two hours oh so time now for susan susan covered what two plus a half two hours and a half or two hours and 30 minutes two and a half hours or you can say two and 30 two hours and 30 minutes and 30 minutes two hours 30 minutes okay Distance, so we know distance is going to be the same. Let's see if it's true. Distance by Susan equal to 80 t plus, okay, what is t plus a half? Two hours and 30 minutes times eight. So we can say two and a half times eight. Okay, so distance by Susan, we're going to say uh, distance by Susan equal to, because they must say, what the distance covered by Susan? So we're going to say 80 times t plus a half is two and a half. So two and a half is like two times uh, two equal to uh, four plus one equal to five. Power by two divided by two divided by two equal to forty. Forty times fifty equal to um, two two hundred kilometer. So distance covered by uh, by Susan is two hundred one kilometer. What about the distance covered by Teboho? We can get it too because distance covered by Teboho equal to hundred times t. So hundred times two which also equal to 200 also they cover the same distance you see what i'm saying they cover the same distance but the time of table was two hours and a half so i can say uh two plus a half two hours and a half or two hours and 30 minutes but the same in hours so two hours and a half but time this is going to be just two hours so it makes a lot of sense because susan she was moving slowly that's why she covered more time but the distance cover the same, but the table holds moving fast, but, and then he cover less time, and you can see it make a lot of sense. So that's how you do this question. Well, according to the question, this was the question which needed to solve the value of t. But for the most case, they're gonna ask you here, oh, this is covered by Susan, this is covered by table hole, and whatever, just like I would say. Look, you FaceTime, make sure you subscribe, share this video to a lot of people. Bye and peace, I'm out.